Good morning. This morning we came together and we prayed, we worshiped, and we acknowledge and remember people that were in our lives um, who have transitioned during this point. Uh, one of the things that we were reminded of this morning is our gifts, the gifts that God has given us. Um, are you walking in your purpose? Um, and so this is a time where you can be still and take inventory of your talents and your gifts. Um, are they aligned with where you're going? Um, are things that you were doing before this pandemic, uh, were you just doing them to do them? Were they bringing you joy? Uh, were they filling you with passion? Um, and if they weren't, that's okay. You know, you're in a place where uh, you can explore and see where it is that God is taking you uh, and know that miracles still happen in our midst um, and people are able to bring joy to one another. And so today the invitation is that you continue to call upon your loved ones, celebrate your loved ones, let them know that you love them um, and that you're there. And so uh, tomorrow we will be uh, on the prayer line at 830. Um, you can find the number as part of this post. You can also find my number um, if you want to uh, chat or if you have a prayer petition that you, you would like us to pray for. Uh, and just know that we have been praying for the petitions that have been coming forth in the last 30 days and we have not stopped. It's not that, you know, once we pray and we hear our testimony, we stop praying for that person. So our prayer list is long and we are grateful uh, to be able to stand in the gap for our brothers and sisters. And so if you want to be part of the Facebook um, page as well, you can find that at the as part of this post and we welcome you with open arms so have a beautiful day full of love joy and abundance and i look forward to hearing your beautiful voices tomorrow at 8 30.